thank you so much for watching. So today we'll be talking about EM or earnest money. Dollar signs, make sure you stay tuned so that you can watch the rest. so much for watching so again we're talking about earnest money today what in the world is earnest money well earnest money usually typically in some markets is about one percent of the sales price that you're offering or in our market it will be um, $500 if it's if the house is under a hundred thousand and a thousand dollars or more if the house is above a hundred thousand dollars well still Jasmine you're telling me that I have to give this earnest money what does it mean earnest money is good faith money it's just showing that you are serious about purchasing the property at the end of the day earnest money is still your money it does not belong to the seller uh, unless you default on buying the house of course so how does earnest money work well you when whenever you're renting a home people are familiar with renting a home you put a deposit so that you can actually get the property whenever you move out you get your deposit back earnest money works very similar to that um, if you are moving into a house 150,000 for example and you put a earnest money deposit of a thousand dollars then at the, that would mean that you are serious about getting the house and they will take the house off the market they will start stop marketing it as available and they will now make it pending sale or under contract then at that moment whenever you actually get to closing your earnest money is credited back to you what does that mean remember i said credited not returned then the difference is that um, if you need to bring any money to the table, like let's say you have a down payment of $5,000 that you have to bring to the table, well then the earnest money, if you already gave a $1,000 deposit, they subtract that from the, um, the, subtract the earnest money from the amount that you're supposed to bring to the table. And instead of bringing 5,000, you'll just bring 4,000. That's just for easy math purposes. So what is earnest money it is a good faith money it is a deposit that you are interested and serious about buying this property once you close on the house the earnest money gets credited back to you so don't be afraid it's still your money it's just that you're serious about buying this house when will your realtor use it so uh, once you decide to actually buy the property the realtor is going to come up to you and say like okay we're under contract i need my earnest money so, so at that moment well it's not the realtor's earnest money it's still your money again but they're going to need that check written immediately after you're under contract some realtors like to get the earnest money check at the same time as they're writing the contract either way is fine it's still permissible um, I believe you have about three days after you're under contract to turn in your earnest money so thank you so much for watching please make sure you subscribe like and stay tuned for more real estate lingo like this